Hello, today we embark on an exciting journey back in time to explore the sitcom Are You Being Served? I'm sure many of you have fond memories of this classic show. Are You Being Served? is a timeless gem that has left indelible mark on television history. Join us as we relive the magic, revisiting those with the entire cast of then and now. We will explore the names and initial ages of the talented actors on the show and witness their transformation in 2024. So without further ado, let's dive into the world of Are You Being Served? Trevor Bannister was born in 1934. In the sitcom, he plays Mr. Lucas. In 1972, when he joined the sitcom, he was 38 years old, and sadly he passed away on April 14, 2011, at 76. Isn't that romantic? You know, I'm sorry I missed all that, really. Still, no matter what happens, even in spite of me, here's the eardrums and me flat. Oh, no, not really. I think I died in about the first 15 minutes. <laughs> A year later, your studies are curtailed when you're called up for army service and you get- Frank Thornton was born in 1921. In the sitcom, he plays Captain Peacock. In 1972, when he was in the sitcom, he was 51 years old, and sadly he passed away on March 16, 2013, at the age of 92. Good moment, sir. <laughs> we are, of course, willing to accept the return of your garment, but um, it is not our policy to refund. We can, however, give you- it's a long time ago, and I'm a very old man. <laughs> Have you enjoyed today? Oh, yes. These, these, they're always fun these days. <laughs> Molly Sutton was born in 1922. In the sitcom, she plays Mrs. Slocomb. In 1972, when she was in the sitcom, she was 50 years old. And unfortunately, she passed away on July 1st, 2009, at 86. And Miss Browns, one moment, please. And Miss Browns! Before we go any further, Mr. Rumbold, Miss Brahms and I would like to compare. Spelled I S A B E L, Mary. But I've never been called anything except Molly. You see, my mother didn't. John Inman was born in 1935. In the sitcom, he plays Mr. Humphreys. In 1972, when he was in the sitcom, he was 37 years old, and sadly he passed away on March 8, 2007, at 71. Warm in the oven, yes. Tell her to turn the regulo down to a quarter. If she hardens that crust, it'll play havoc with your gums. <laughs> I played things like removal men, you know. <laughs> I'd, I'd arrive at somebody's door with a wardrobe under my arm and say... Arthur English was born in 1919. In the sitcom, he plays Mr. Harmon. In 1976, when he joined the sitcom, he was 57 years old, and sadly he passed away on April 16, 1995, at 75. Big cock, but you might have twigged that none of the ladies and gentlemen dummies is wearing wigs. Due to an oversight from display, what I am going to rectify. Then be quick. Somebody to hold the tape. Well, no, but we're short-handed, as usual. Do you mean to say there's a vacancy for somebody to work here? Don't tell me you're interested, are you? Nicholas Smith was born in 1934. In the sitcom, he plays Mr. Rumbold. In 1972, when he joined the sitcom, he was 38, and sadly he passed away on December 6, 2015, at 81. We used to improvise. Now, let's all think very carefully. <laughs> Camping. And so finally, he said, it was while I was in the army, I had to do two years in the army. He said, well, I'll have an agreement with you. If you can get in... Wendy Richard was born in 1943. In the sitcom, she plays Mrs. Brams. In 1972, when she was in the sitcom, she was 29 years old, and sadly she passed away on February 26, 2009, at 65. Slocum, that man's been hanging around our underwear counter for the past 10 minutes. Oh dear. Do you think he's one of those? One of what? Side effects are because really, I mean, apart from the hair loss, uh, the worst side effect I've had has been the ulcerated mouth. Mm. A, you lose your, you lose. Alfie Bayes was born in 1916. In the sitcom, he plays Mr. Goldberg. In 1979, when he joined the sitcom, he was 63 years old, and sadly he passed away on July 16, 1987, at 71. Oh, we are the staff. <laughs> what a mistake to make <laughs> before I've even started. Shall I go? No, 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 of course not. Uh, please take a seat. Arthur Brough was born in 1905. In the sitcom, he plays Mr. Granger. In 
In 1972, when he joined the sitcom, he was 67 years old, and sadly he passed away on May 28, 1978, at the age of 73. Are you free, Mr. Granger? Yes, I'm free. <laughs> Good afternoon. Good afternoon, Mr. Grace. Vivian Johnson was born in 1946. In the sitcom, she plays Mr. Grace's nurse. In 1978, when she joined the sitcom, she was 32 years old, and now she's 78. Try, but you can't hide common, can you? I'm sorry to interrupt, but it's almost time for Mr. Grace's special medicine. That's it. That's the voice. It's sexy. Tony Simpson was born in 1906 in the sitcom he plays Claude. In 1976, when he joined the sitcom, he was 70, and sadly he passed away on March 30th, 1983, at 76. Hear me! <laughs> if ever I saw a guilty man, it's him. <laughs> Mike Berry was born in 1942. In the sitcom, he plays Mr. Spooner. In 1981, when he was in the sitcom, he was 39, and now he's 81 years old. He's entertaining Miss Featherstone in my chair today. Yes, and the head of accounts is the one that sanctions rises for managers. Uh, possibly. Uh, but the, uh, the age limit was the reason. Harold Bennett was born in 1898. In the sitcom, he plays young Mr. Grace. In 1972, when he joined the sitcom, he was 74, and sadly he passed away on September 11, 1981, at 82. It's a surprise. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very nice of you all. I, I've given a lot of these away, but I've never got that. <laughs> when we reflect on the incredible journey of Are You Being Served that took place between 1972 and 1985, Witnessing their growth and transformation, we can see that the connection from those years left a lasting legacy. Their story continues to resonate with fans around the world. And as always, show some love, hit the like button, subscribe for more, and hit the bell to never miss my new content.